pass on. So maybe they didn't see him in the excitement or maybe the back or something, but uh, no, there was only one suspect. Did you encounter the, did they encounter the suspect uh, at his home? Was he here just visiting someone? Yeah, we don't think he has any uh, home here or anything to do with this. I'm not sure why he was here. Again, surveillance was going on, uh, but I'm not sure. I don't think he lives here and has any connections here. Surveillance of the suspect or surveillance of the area? Of the suspect. So they followed him to this location? Well, I don't know if they followed him here or how they knew that he was here, but he, they did encounter him here. Can you give us talk about the trooper's condition and stuff right after the shooting as far as treatment here on the scene? You know, I don't know because I didn't, I wasn't here available at that time. I didn't get here until probably 30 minutes until it was after, and he was already taken away. But again, uh, it's very uh, good news, and uh, talked to our superintendent who's with him down there now, and it appears to be a, a hand injury on Does it appear, Sergeant, that one, one of your troopers was involved in the shooting, or were there others that fired their weapons as well? No, there was only one. Yeah, That's what we know right now. Fired. No, not right now. Again, it's very early. Our uh, CSI guys are just now getting there to do the evidence collection, and the, and the uh, detectives are canvassing the area to talk to us, or to talk to the uh, and the uh, witnesses. witnesses. Correct that you have all spoke to also. So it's going to be a little while yet before we have the whole story. So do we know that the suspect shot the officer? Is there been a weapon that's been recovered? There has been a weapon recovered. Correct. Can you walk over again where this started and you know where we ended up in this pursuit? I don't know exactly where it started. It started here in the apartment complex, over around somewhere around a lake out here. I'm not familiar with this area, but and uh, it went quite a bit through the apartment complex, is what I understood that they chased for quite a while. Was this a state police investigation or was this an IMP investigation or was no? This joint? this was a I believe this was a joint investigation, but I know state police was heading it out. Now, can you tell us anything about the suspect? I do not know. I don't know his name. Uh, uh, he's a black male. That's all we know right now. And you started as a drug surveillance operation? Right, correct. And where did that start? Well, that's been ongoing for quite some time, yeah. It's just not started today. It's been ongoing with this gentleman for a while. Sergeant Myers, there was a gray truck back back over there uh, being investigated around the scene. Was that being used by troopers? Was that being used by the suspect? You heard I didn't, anything about a I didn't, vehicle? What kind of was it? A gray truck. Not familiar with it, sorry. I don't know. Were there any drugs confiscated at all? I, again, the CSI people have just started, so I haven't found out what they found out yet either. So while, while the suspect was running, was he firing a weapon while he was running? No, I understand that he was brandishing at the officers, but okay. there was no fire shots fired during the pursuit itself. Okay. Just right. when they left over the fence, the one trooper followed him, that's when the shots started. Okay. Do you know who shot first? No. Uh, the suspect showed his gun first, and that's what that's what started the initiative. Yes. Where on the body was the suspect hit? I can't tell you that either. I don't know. I haven't been up to that part. Okay. Thanks, guys. Appreciate your time.